Hey everybody, it's Ignited Coyote, and we're at Camp Blanton in Harlan, Kentucky. Camp Blanton is part of Blanton Forest. In 1995, the first 1,075 acres of old growth forest on the south face of Pine Mountain in Harlan County was dedicated as Blanton Forest State Nature Preserve. The Blanton Forest State Nature Preserve now protects over 3,000 acres of old growth forest. Forest, forest, forest. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> uh, of old growth forest. Forest. Well, I got trouble with that, Donna. Uh, too late to go back now. Uh, it's one of 13, only 13, one of only 13 tracks of old growth forest in the eastern United States and the oldest growth forest in the state of Kentucky. Several th trees here have been dated to the 1600s. There's over 400 different variety of plants that have been identified in Blanton Forest. Now, of course, Blanton Forest, you can't do the whole thing in one video. It, it, it's big and wonderful and that, you know, anybody's gonna have to come back and do a couple of them. They got Knobby Rock here. <clears throat> it's a three air hike up to hit and uh, it, it deserves a video all of its own. It's beautiful, got a beautiful view and we will do that, God willing. I believe this used to be the, the buildings you're looking at now, part of the old Boy Scout camp in Harlan, Kentucky. That's what I've been told. And as usual, anyone with better information on anything I do, more accurate information, please comment. Help this channel out, help us out, help us stay accurate. I mean, it's something when you think of how little old growth forest there is. And for the folks in Southeast Kentucky to have the oldest growth forest in Kentucky right here in their backyard, that's amazing. There's a pond. I do believe you can fish in that pond if you get a permit. Looks like a caretaker's house right there. Looks like a bear proofed dumpster. I wouldn't be surprised if we saw a bear. Just listen how beautiful this is. And yes, in this part of Kentucky, uh, it's not unusual to see bears in the dead of winter. It just don't get all that cold, at least by bear standards. After the flooding we had a few weeks ago, I've had people say they've seen some snakes that got uh, washed out of hibernation. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't that beautiful? Like I said, this uh, this place deserves a uh, couple of videos, two or three or four.
Oh, look at this. This is just really beautiful. My goodness. Boy, this is lovely, folks. This, this, this is just, just beautiful. I, I'll try to keep my mouth shut so you guys can just enjoy it. Folks, this right here is a treasure. It really is. This is just a... This is just a treasure. Looks like some picnic areas over there across the pond. Is it just my imagination, or is this starting to kind of look like Camp Crystal Lake? Whoa! <laughs> Some kind of birds just shot right up out of the road in front of me. I was looking at this tree. Wow, look at that. You start looking at these trees and you kind of get what they mean by old growth forest, don't you? Look at that. I mean, this is the kind of place that just tickles you to see it. This is the wildlife, the birds. I wish I knew birds a little better. Let me check with my 
let me check with my bird expert walking behind me here. My bird expert walking behind me said he'd never heard him before either. <laughs> He's not a bird expert, but he knows a lot more about stuff like that than I do. Of course, you don't, you don't have a go-to for to know a lot more about anything than I do. This looks like a probably an archery setup, maybe where they uh, practice archery. God, ain't that beautiful? I think you can rent these cabins. Is that an outhouse? I'd probably want just slightly more modern conveniences than that. <laughs> Boy, that is primitive <laughs> if that's one. Look how beautiful that is though. Yeah, the further back we get, it looks like the more cabins they've got. Wow, it looks like they lost a big th tree there to uh, lightning or wind. Right, uh, yeah, right there. Look at this. Oh, they've got a swimming pool over there. Considering it's about a 37 degrees right now, I'm sure it's closed. This is really nice. Folks, if you're visiting Southeast Kentucky, not just Harlan. If you're visiting anywhere, you know, uh, people tell you see Cumberland Falls, and yes, go see Cumberland Falls. Come up here and see this. Come up here and stay. 
this is uh, th this is definitely something you don't want to go back home and miss. And like I said, there's lots of hiking trails. There's Knobby Rock, a beautiful rock. It's a three hair hike and a one way. At least that's what the sign said back there. So uh, we'll come back and do a video on that. I definitely want to come back and do uh, several videos, but uh, this is definitely a place you want to see if you get anywhere close to it. We'll come back in the spring and the summer, hopefully, and uh, see how beautiful it is then. Well, like I said, I'll uh, try to keep my mouth shut as much as possible so you guys can just enjoy this. Camp Forest Circle. Looks like it's kind of muddy in there right now because we did have flooding and a lot of rain in this area. Look at this, look at this beautiful old tree. Look at that. Right there where it stood, I'm pretty sure. Just lived out its life and uh, fell down, or maybe they may have cut it down because it's what they call a widow maker. And obviously, this is a close to campsites. Folks, we will, uh, like I said, I want to come back when these trails are not. If you look back there, right there, you can see that this one is just pretty much washed out. Well, these a lot of these trails aren't this muddy and we'll uh, especially in the spring and summer we'll do some more videos here You look how tall that tree is. Look at this guy. Folks, it's such a blessing to be alive and just to be able to see things like this and enjoy it. Do you know that? Hey, like I said, I was uh, talking to the caretaker a few minutes ago. Really nice guy. Takes care of this place. He's telling about the bear that uh, flipped a dumpster over the other night. He said that this was actually still a Boy Scout camp. They still came up here and done stuff. So, uh, yeah, it not only used to be, like I said at the beginning of the video, it still is. He said you can rent these cabins. He said uh, they slept up to, I think he said, 12 Said you got the fishing is a beautiful little pond here. God man, that's beautiful. 
I think I wore the word beautiful out up here today. Like I said, I found out you can uh, rent these cabins and that the outhouse on the hill behind this one did used to actually be an outhouse, but it's just there for historical purposes now. It's not functioning, so if you got to go, don't go there. Hey folks, I mentioned the caretaker telling me about a bear turning over a dumpster a night or two ago. Is that a bear print? Can you even see it on my camera? walk over here maybe we can find whatever did it <laughs> now nah, I'm just joking I don't want to find whatever did it look at these trees these laurel bushes A little bit of green even in the dead of winter.
Hey folks, thank you for spending a little time with us at Camp Blanton, the gateway to the Blanton Forest Nature Preserve. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, share. Thank you so much for supporting this channel. From Blanton Forest in Harlan, Kentucky. Bye.